All right, come on in. Hit the like button. Think about subscribing if already. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. But most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is my personal review for a film that I think has been out a month, and it's been kind of getting raves about it, or a lot of raves about it. I mean, kind of. It's a 2023 Netflix film called Sorority of the Snow, based on the on real events. Plot. In 1972, an, an Argentinian flight crashes in the remote heart of Andes, forcing survivors to be, uh, become each other's best hope. Here is some of the cast. This film was absolutely horrifying to watch. They really did a great job of making you feel like you were there with them trying to survive. The choice of score and the super detailed sound effects added to that. From the crunching of the snow to the uh, clanging of the plane parts. The pacing was perfect, slow, but fast at the same time. A slight break when needed, but quickly right back into the hell storm of the survival. At first, I personally wasn't a big fan of the constant close-up shots of the faces, but it, it but came to the realization that those shots gave you that feeling of dizziness and chaos. Uh, but there was also much great air shots and landscape shooting to give you that scope of things. Everything about how this was directed was done so perfect, I see why this got nominated. I don't know if it got awards, but I know it's been nominated. Or I think like it nominated a bunch of stuff. But uh, here's my random come back my final thoughts. It's such a great and intense film. From its storytelling to the performance, I highly recommend this film. Like, highly recommend it. Um, but as always, leave your comments down below. Now, I don't know how true to the actual story of this, that this was based on, because usually Hollywood kind of fabricate a lot of stuff, but I have gotten a strong feeling because uh, that the this was pretty, pretty spot on considering that there are two people in the movie films, and they're like, I don't know how old they are, but they're way older, because this was in the 70s, and they were like 20s back then. Uh, they were in the protection of the production of the film. So that's just say really something about it. Um, but so far, I, I, it's only been two months almost, or a month and a half of 2024. Honestly, this is the best film so far, um, in my opinion, but... Yeah, so again, always let me let me know your opinions down below. But in the meantime, remember, I love you all. Please stay safe. Remember, spread the love most poorly. Skull.